Yo, what is going on guys? It is Oilers Fan 97 here. And today we're back with a uh, a really good video today. Um, I have not seen these at all opened really on the channel, so I thought this would be a fun opening. I had to do some Christmas shopping and uh, obviously not at your best pals Walmart, but um, I saw these mystery tins and uh, they were, I think they were like 15 a piece or something stupid. So um, picked up four of them. And I uh, thought it'd be a fun opening for this one. Um, with you do get four factory seal packs, I do believe. Uh, this says looks for one uh, seated one or two mystery item packs, whatever it is. Maybe I don't know. And then I know you do get cards in here as well. Obviously, we're looking to chase uh, the 1516 packs for McDavid. Um, you know what? If we could hit one of those packs, uh, I. I'd be really happy. These tins are also really cool because they're uh, kind of collectible, but from your best pals, MJ is holding as well. So yeah, I decided to get four of these pretty good, reasonable price. I see, uh, I've seen some people kind of, uh, kind of overprice these. They auction it and try to get more out of it, but uh, I'm obviously not about that. So, um, yeah, I want to, uh, get this open. So let's get busting and, uh, Let's go with box number one. Mystery tin number one here. Let's see who we get from your best pals. So, all right. All right, cool little mystery tin. Um, ooh, Matt Fratt, you get relics and stuff, but uh, ultimate rookie jersey of Matt Fratt into 200 there. Just sitting up the top, of course, no sleeve. Um, very uh, unprotected. So here's our pack. It's 17, 18 series one. That's actually solid, um, considering Tage Thompson's chance. Uh, there's a bunch of others. Um, see our four packs. So oh, okay. Let's uh, let's take a look. So we're gonna go by one by one by ten. And there's a little protection. Little tins get off to the side there. So we got 13, 14 score. Which is actually a solid class. I mean, that wasn't a terrible year score. Of course, we have to get 12 13, so that's going to be garbage. And then 15 16 series two. Chance of McDavid Young on canvas. I mean, this, this isn't terrible. This definitely isn't the worst. Um, yeah, let's get ripping in this. This crap score. Maybe there's potential of hitting something good in here, but we'll see. Well, hopefully, something surprising, but. Uh, we got a team score of Guinea Malk in there and Cam Ward season highlights. So, all right. <clears throat> so, let's get on a 13 14 score here. Obviously, Nathan McKinnon here, Neil Yakupov. Oh boy. Um, so, yeah, the four packs definitely not terrible. Um, like I said, I haven't really seen this stuff open on the channel. So, I thought this would be a fun video for you guys. Uh, you know, hitting close to Christmas too. So, uh, it'd be a fun little opening. Uh, hot rookies there. It's actually a solid one. Alex Kalorn. The Tampa Bay Lightning. That's pretty cool. Uh, Mark Edward Vlasic Gold. Luke Shen. I remember opening up a fair bit of score. I remember 13 14. I did. I don't. I didn't go any lower because, I mean, that class was pretty good. I opened the jumbo boxes, I believe, but yeah. Let's get a chance at a young gun here, potentially. Or, or yeah, you know, just. Get us potential base packs is what's possible too. Matt Murray, yeah. So that's that's that. Base in your face. All right, last pack from box number one or tin number one. Sorry. Let's see, if anything good comes out here, or you know, two base packs in a row. Oh yeah, shit happens. <laughs> All right, so yeah, first tin was a no-brainer, so. All right, <clears throat> on to box number two here. Let's get into it. So, so far, just a Kalorn. All right. I mean, the value of potential is definitely there for 15 bucks. I mean, uh, I know people like to, once they see a video, they go forward to Walmarts, but... I know for a fact that these are, you know, they're fun little openings, but uh, there's our other hit, and it's David Runblad. Little, little jersey piece there. 
Let's see what the packs... Oh, they wanted to be friendly fire today and give us three packs of that score. And one pack of Series 1 there with Peter Budai. Or, sorry, David uh, Runblad jersey. So, at least you get in at least a jersey card. But uh, definitely pretty cool. All right, this score stuff, let's just zoom into it. Riley Shahan and uh, Rick DiPietro there. You can tell I love score already. Alright. Brandon Bowling and Peace. <laughs> As I'm casually just. Alright. Auto potential in this is really rare. Jose Theodore, uh, Netcam, and Claude Giroux. All right. Garbage. That's what it is. <laughs> Score for you. So let's see if we can hit a young gun. What oh, we do? All right, I'll take it. Jake DeBrusque. You know, that's a solid one. Uh, that's very solid. Jake DeBrusque. Dude's been, I think, on the top line for the Bruins, so I'll, uh, I'll take that all day. Jake DeBrus there. It's pretty nice there out of uh, box two. Better than box one. I uh, see what box three delivers. Hopefully something. And, uh, all right, let's let's actually hide the, the hit. Oh, actually, there's no hit yet. All right. So it actually doesn't actually have a hit. We actually have a bonus pack, so five and no cards. Actually, I like that. <laughs> All right. Tins are pretty cool, especially if you want to do mystery items or just in general. Oh, God. 809 victory. Jeez. Another two packs of score. That's our favorite. So we'll kind of... Uh... Let's go like this. Uh, 16, 17 Parkers is still solid with Matthews, obviously. So, with the beeper, don't worry. Oh, God. Joe Sackick. Peter Buda. Or, uh, Mueller. Uh, Pascal. Kovalev. And a Game Breakers, Marty St. Louis. Yeah, victory was not a high-end set, that's for sure. It was definitely quite the low end. All right. All right, hot rookies, Michael Hutchinson. All right, Michael Hutchinson. Right. Milan, Lucic. Oh, I thought that was Paul Bizonet, but... Uh... Junk. That's what it is. Alright. Parker's there's still potential. I remember actually pulling an auto in uh this, but uh oh god, this is pretty sticky. Pretty sticky. Alright. Oh, I forgot it was in the middle there. Corey Crawford. Oh my god. Daniel Sedin. A hey, Tyler Mott. Turned down for what? Um, silver, black rookie. Pretty cool. Nothing out of that. All right, let's see what Series 1's got. What is Series 1 giving to us here? Go two for two. And Gustav Nyquist portraits. I mean, there's still potential. Like I said, this, this stuff is, you know, I mean... Oh, we haven't hit the odds of what it's saying. Um, I mean, these packs, obviously, with their advertising, definitely false information for sure. Um, but at least you have a chance at um, at the potential of, uh, you know, at least the pack or, you know, of the, the bigger names-ish. So, all right. Oh, I like how that card's just vibe in there, but it's for the Oilers. That's pretty cool. 
kind of a ding corner there. Jesus, that, that got ringed around there. <laughs> I remember this guy in the Oilers, Timu Harkainen. Uh, rookie dual jersey for the Oilers to 200. Something you don't see all day. It seems like a lot of uh, ultimate threads, but uh, it's from 11-12 actually, so pretty cool, pretty cool. All right, get this wax out of here and kind of the same repeat. So I have four boxes, nothing, uh, I mean, too great, but the potential still, like I said, rock solid, so. All right, let's see what this score junk got. Oh God, all right, uh, so in Berchi and that guy. Galov, Mike Smith, Aaron Ness, and yeah, that's why you love score, love score. All right, 13, 14, we'll treat it properly this time, ish, sort of, <laughs> I'm just kidding. All right, Bobby Ryan, rest in peace, Bobby Ryan. Uh, hopefully he gets better. <laughs> uh, Dustin Panner. Yeah, it's score team leaders of uh, the LA Kings, Carter, Kopitar, uh, LRB, and Quick. And Mark Street, gold. Mike Green, uh, that's Shattenkirk, and Eric Fair. All right, last pack. Let's see if we can... At least get one more young guns with uh, big C looking like that. Let's see. Oh, we do. So uh, let's see. Oh my God, everyone's favorite, Josh Hosang. I mean, you know, I'll take it. I'll take it. Two young guns out of four uh, mystery tins. You know what? That's pretty solid. So, you know what? We're not gonna complain. At fifteen dollars a piece, not terrible. Definitely for sixty bucks Canadian for all four of these. Is it really worth it? I mean. Like I said, what they advertise on there is kind of BS in my opinion, but uh, yeah, two young guns, not too bad, but definitely not the worst. So there you have it, guys. Thanks guys so much for watching. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe, and uh, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed these tins, and yeah, we'll see you in the next video. Peace. Merry Christmas to everyone all the way, by the way. Peace.